Are you think you're gonna be the messy one or the clean one? Maybe, I hope Shao's the messy one. Apparently, Hanny did something to Cosette. All right, I just got done with the room. I'm gonna call the boys up and see what they think. So, what's your favorite part of the room, boys? Or Shiloh? Guess what, Shiloh? We are getting ready to do Shiloh and Ezra's bedroom. It is one of the first things I like to get done are the kids' bedrooms when we move into a new house. <sighs> so I wanna surprise the boys with getting their room all set up. I don't think that they're gonna expect me to get everything done today. I don't even know if I can do the entire room today, but it's gonna be my goal and I would love to surprise them. So let's go and see if we can get it done. Look at this room, you guys. Do you guys like your new bedroom? It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's, I like it. I don't know how, how when we're going to be able to get everything done, but do you guys like your new room? Yeah, but we have Beyblades outside. We really want to play with them. You are, are you going to go play with your Beyblades? Yeah. yeah so you Ezra. you said you'll get us launchers, not Beyblades and launchers. I know. I'm such a nice mom. Okay. Which closet do you guys... Who wants which closet? I'll have this closet. Okay. That was easy. closet my bed. Okay, are you guys gonna keep your closet clean this time? Yeah. Okay, yeah. and this and this time I'm gonna get to know who's who's the messy one and who's the clean one. Wow. Because you'll have your own closet. So then we can mommy, see who's messy wait, and who's clean. But mommy. <laughs> Exercise. Are you think you're gonna be the messy one or the clean one? Maybe. I hope Shaw's the messy one. <laughs> Currently this is the garage. Check it out. We have everything down here and I one thing I like to do when I am unpacking is go through one box at a time. If I have like a hundred boxes in the house, I don't know, my brain just does not work that way. It gets overwhelmed. I need to do one box at a time and put it away and then do the next box and then put it away. That is the only way I have figured out that I can stay sane and organized without the whole house being bombarded with boxes and just stuff everywhere. The only downside is that I have to go around looking in each box, trying to see if I find the boy stuff for the boys' room because that is currently what I am looking for. Oh, this is one of them. And then those two, um, these two orange lockers go in their bedroom as well. And one of these dressers, I gotta figure out which one is theirs and which one is Cosette's. Um, actually, this one is theirs, I think, cause theirs is missing uh, a little um, hardware piece. Apparently, Hanny did something to Cosette. Yeah, what'd you do to her? Oh my gosh, you look cute! Wait, 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 ready? Oh, you look adorable! Oh, hello, but I think those are the first little pants she's ever worn. And actually, didn't the viewer send that outfit to us? I don't know, but I, think I so. found it in my room. Cute, cute girl. That's the first time she's ever worn pants. I don't know what I think about that. It's cute. It and is it's cute. Got butt. It matches her little headband, though. It's cute. Got butt. You got a ruffled butt. You yeah, cute girl. Purpose.
right, I just got done with the room. I'm gonna call the boys up and see what they think. Um, it, it looks really cute up here. I like the way this room is set up a lot better than their old room. It just complements everything well, and I like how I kind of rearranged a few things and added a couple things. Also, we do not have curtains yet. I think I need to get, um, okay, in the comments below, tell me what color curtains we should get for this room. Orange, green, brown, gray, or light blue, because those are like the main colors of this room. So I'm just gonna give you guys a little tour before they come up here. They have these cute little things up here, and I did their beds. I cannot find Ezra's other pillow, but it's somewhere. Instead of hanging their lockers on the wall, I put it there so they can use them as like little nightstands, which I thought would be really cute. Over here, I have their little dresser, and I put their signs. This will be for more stuffed animals and stuff, and then I always have this fun little thing so they can like put up pictures and little things. Um, I've got them a little bookcase and a little, I put this spinning chair up in here, and I thought they would like that. They can read there, and it just, it looks so cute. Let me see if I can get farther back. So this is both of them. I just think it is so adorable. All right, well, let's go see what the boys think. All right, you guys ready? Okay, it took me all day, but I actually got your room all the way finished. Are you guys excited to see it? Okay, I'm gonna go in there first and then come in when I say ready, okay? Okay, don't look in there, don't peek. Close your eyes. What do you think? OP, oh, he's like, that's awesome. Yeah, that's funny. You love it? Yeah. Lock so. I said it was big. No. So I put your lockers there because look, you can use it as a nightstand. Like, put a little water on there. Yeah. And then I gave you guys the spinny chair because it matched your room. So. You're already making a mess. And then you guys have a, a little bookshelf so you guys can read your books. I love the room. It's super cool. Um, and um, so, like when you put the lockers on the ground, it's cool because you can use it as a stand and you can put stuff in it. It's super duper cool. And um, I like that the spinny chair is in here. Mm -hmm. I really like it. I like that too. So what's your favorite part of the room, boys? My favorite part is my bed. Is your bed? What's your favorite part, Shiloh? My part is the lockers. The lockers, yeah. And so I thought it was cool because you guys sit in there and you can see out the window from sitting on your bed. Isn't that nice? Yeah. Yeah, and it just like you have like a light, lot of nice light coming in and stuff. In the sunlight. Yeah, totally. So that was, that was so funny. I was like, where'd Shepard go? And all of a sudden I see Jason driving around the corner and Shepard's in his lap on the truck. So he just like came out of the garage and I guess Shepard was like, I want to drive with you. And sometimes Jason will like let him drive like up the driveway in the car. It was so funny. I was like, wait a minute, Shepard's in the car? How did he get out there? But I guess he, he like saw when daddy was here and ran out there. Uh, so I told Hanny, I was like, I don't know. I don't know if this is working for me. Hey, you said, so I put that cute outfit on Cosette and apparently she wasn't girly enough. Yeah. So I made myself totally not girly. I know. Hanny's wear, mom. you're wearing daddy's hat. <laughs> you were just a goofball. What are you doing, Kai? I'm doing awesome stuff that is so secretive that no one can know. Okay, I'll just leave it at that. <gasps> Did Shepard find you? Yeah, I saw it. What is that? Oh, yeah, so I had to get a new flat iron because apparently I left mine at the hotel. Shiloh, you forgot my flat iron at the hotel. No, of course he did. Oh, and now we have to also use cutting boards, which is so crazy because. We have always had granite, granite, but this is like, I don't know, linoleum wood. or something. So wood. now we have Tiny to use girls. cutting board. Shiloh, guess what, Shiloh? What? Guess what I got at the store? Mm -hmm. Stuff to make Uncle Micah's famous guacamole. <gasps> Yay! And so, and Daddy just got this cutting board so I could make it. They, they, they were, were touching what? A dead bird. A dead bird. I mean, don't, don't let anything Shepherd, Ew. Oh, okay, put it up on the counter. Put it up there. Mommy, how is that book going to get dead? It might have ran into a window, or I'm not sure. Yeah? I'm not sure. Are you sad that he's dead? Sometimes birds die. Sometimes. Um, because sometimes they, they like they're flying like this and then they accidentally run into like a window or something. Oh my god! Oh, 
to die. You don't want the birds to die? No. I know. That is actually Daddy. really sad, isn't it, honey? Do you want, Shepard, do you want Daddy to hang up the swing? Yeah. She's so awesome. Let me see. What do you have over there? Yes. Got a cutting board? For some reason, Abby is like, hey, I want to see this cutting board. So I was thinking we're going to hang the swing in the middle here. Are you helping Daddy? Here, give it to Daddy. Look right here. You give him one. Give me one, Chef. Give Daddy one. Thanks, <laughs> We are getting the swing up. We're so excited. Battery time. Battery time. We're hoping to get it up there, but the battery's dying, and we don't know where the charger is to the drill. Oh, no! Oh, no! It happened! <gasps> what happened? Oh, my God. The light's going on? <gasps> Whoa. Oh my goodness. Ready? One. Two. And there he goes, having so much fun. Seriously, every household with children needs to have a swing. <laughs> what happened? Let me see. Oh, oh, he died. I saw that, the swing got you and then you died? Oh. <laughs> Live the epic life and inspire someone with your story.